At the Australian World Time Attack Challenge event, we ran into a lot of different drivers. Some were rookies, and some were the textbook definition of professional hot shoe. Australian rally star Steve Glennie is one of the latter. Uh, Steve Glennie uh, from Australia, driving a Mazda RX-7 FD, and a Mitsubishi Evo, and a Subaru STI. Yeah, I've been, I've been driving for about 10 years uh, out here in Australia. Um, started off um, doing a few motor car events and then uh, did Target Tasmania, um, and then switched to uh, gravel, did some Australian Rally Championship events on gravel, um, and just been doing selected circuit and rally events since then. Fresh off of competition in the Target Tasmania Tarmac Rally Race, Glennie was brought in to drive not one, not two, but three different cars in the time attack. The modified RX-7, Subaru STI, and Lancer Evo all featured big turbos, lots of power, incredible track speed, and the need for a good driver. Yeah, look, fantastic weekend. Um, this World Time Attack Challenge has um, really taken off. Huge crowds, great weather here in Sydney. And uh, I was able to set some really quick times uh, in the Evo uh, yesterday, in the Pulse Racing Evo. And um, the RX-7's um, RX gonna be uh, even quicker today as well, so. So um, yeah, great day yesterday. A seasoned rally champion, Glennie has also been the driver behind the wheel of Mazda Motorsport Australia's RX-8 SP Turbo. Together with co-driver Bernie Webb, Glennie most recently took on the Target Tasmania rally in the specially modified RX-8, which featured a turbocharged rotary engine, Alcon brakes, and 18-inch Advan racing tires. Target Tasmania for us this year went really well for the first few days. Uh, we had a Mazda RX-8 SP developed here in Australia with a, with a turbocharged engine. And uh, yeah, we were flying for the first few days um, up there mixing it with the Lamborghini Gallardos and, and Porsche Turbos and GDRs. And um, unfortunately, uh, day three, there was a, an incident with a, another car on track, which we couldn't avoid, which ended our race. But um, yeah, look, we had a, had a great, great run up until then. It was our second year in that car. Um, the first year was basically a development year. And uh, yeah, look, uh, suspension package, tyres, the Advan tyres were Fantastic. The Mazda uh, was just flying, and uh, yeah, to be keeping up with cars worth you know three quarters of a million dollars uh, in a little hundred thousand dollar Mazda was uh, was a big thrill. Yeah, definitely. Look, Mazda are rebuilding a new car uh, for us next year, bigger and better and faster, and uh, we'll certainly be out to win it next year.